What's up everyone, Zalakai here. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. I hope you guys are all having a great day. And I just wanted to say, today starts the gameplay of The Evil Within 2. I just want to apologize ahead of time. I had a little hiccup with the audio of my microphone, so it might be a little low. But the next three episodes, sorry about that. I fixed it, and future episodes, problem solved. Hope you guys enjoy. Commencing now. dying right now that salsa was hot 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 Woo, my nose is on fire play this game <clears throat> today we are playing the evil within two will be episode one I'm gonna do a little series uh, continuous videos of gameplay so I'm gonna try pushing at least three hours per day but also have other stuff in between just because I don't want to do all gameplay video every single day new game Golden Flames, Tragic Fire, Kill the Child, Nanny. That's very classy. Oh. Okay, I'm excited for this. I saw this over at Chief Free. It was just a walkthrough and it was a little weird kind of thing. It was No, this is not happening. <laughs> oh God, Lily! I'm here! Where are you? Oh god, if she appears. How did this happen? <laughs> I'm coming, Lily! Hold on! here you weren't here for me dad hey cutthroat oh you see that the one little chair or a heart hurts But that little scenario, like that room right there, reminds me of Max Payne 3, I think. Yeah, I don't know why, but it's, it, for some reason it does. I think there's a bar scene just like that. Who's this lady? Kidman? It's not a daughter, is it? <laughs> <laughs> 
Hello, Sebastian. It's been a long time. Three years. I've been trying to track you down for three years. And you thought you'd find me at the bottom of an empty bottle. Is that it? And why are you here now, damn it? You didn't find me because they didn't want you to. Calm down, Sebastian. You knew what was going to happen in that hospital, didn't you? What happened at Beacon is in the past. You need to forget it. You sound just like that psychologist that forced shoved down my throat. But he didn't have answers. You do. You're going to tell me about Mobius. Mobius. What the heck is Mobius? <laughs> Mobius or Moby Dick? I'm here because of this. Lily's still alive. Huh? Whoa. That's insane. Lily is dead. Drink. I read the police report. I was at her funeral. We can rewrite history if we want to. Staging a death is child's play. Why would I come out of the shadows just to lie to you? Lily is alive, and she's with us, but she's in danger. We need you to help save her. Save her? What have you done to her? Get your hands off me! I was hoping you'd come willingly, Sebastian. But we don't have time for this bullshit. We need you. Lily needs you. The men in black. Okay, now we wait to see what actually happens. Sebastian? You're awake. Good. Yeah. Great. Where are we? You're in one of our facilities. So this is the almighty Mobius, huh? Be careful about what you say. You don't know how powerful they are. Right. So powerful they have to kidnap a washed-up ex-cop to help them. <laughs> At least your terrible sense of humor is still intact. Enough of this bullshit. Where's Lily? Patience. All your answers are right here. The Beacon Mental Hospital incident was... an unfortunate setback. Who's talking? Hello, but we used the knowledge gained to build a new... I and vastly improved STEM system. What does this have to do with my daughter? Imagine it. Millions of minds connected together. Happiness for one is happiness for all. This machine, this miracle, will allow our species to achieve greatness. We needed to start with a mind that was pure and clean enough to support thousands of personalities. The mind of an innocent child. You connected Lily to that machine? Your daughter is quite special. The most stable core candidate we've ever tested. Thanks to her, the new STEM has been a smashing success. Until recently. A little over a week ago, Lily vanished. Just stopped sending signals. Then the STEM environment began to collapse. We thought it was just a technical glitch. An easy fix, so we sent a team of Mobius agents inside. 
But then we lost contact with them, and STEM went dark. Think about this, Mr. Castellanos. I am providing you an opportunity. Not only to see your daughter again, but to save her life. Something you thought you failed to do before. You can save her, or let her die. It's your choice. Oh yeah, thanks for the choice. Save my daughter, let her die. I wonder what I'm gonna pick. Huh. Good luck, Sebastian. And please, try to cooperate with any team members you might find in there. I know you don't trust us, but they have the same goals as you do. That's all right. I'm fine by myself. Just remember to call me the moment you find Millie, so that we can begin the extraction process. I'll be out here for you. All righty then. And someone else will be in there for you. Whoa, somebody's Are you ready? Getting jacked into the matrix. Let's do this. While laying in a bathtub full of. I'm not even going to get Be careful in there, Sebastian. We're counting on you. STEM entry in three, two, one. Is this... Where am I? I know it's hard to accept Myra, but she's gone. Our little girl is gone. No. I'll never accept it. You won't help me. I'll find out the truth on my own. What the hell is this place? Detective, we've got a call. Terrible. 
Like the worst hangover ever. Don't worry. It will pass once your mind has adjusted. You're in an area separate from the main system right now. That's how we're able to maintain communication with you. This construct is called your room. It's a safe zone that was formed from your own memories. My memories, huh? If that's the case, then where are my wife and child? This place looks like my old office at Crimson City PD. It was your self-conscious that built it. You should ask yourself that question. Let's get down to business. We sent some information into your room. Do you see anything unfamiliar? I'm looking at it right now. There are photos of a bunch of Mobius agents here. Your lost team, I assume. That's them. Let us know if you locate any of them. You're our only line of communication into STEM. They're stuck in Union and searching for Lily, too. Union? This STEM environment was designed to look and feel like a small town called Union. Great. So your experts need rescuing too, huh? If anyone can do it, it's okay. you. Thanks for the vote of confidence, but I'm only the here to find Lily. Awesome. There's more info there. You should check it out before you go. More info? Lily, your team. And now me. We're all stuck inside STEM. I still don't understand why you can't just take them all out of their pods and wake them up. It doesn't work that way. Without a core, we're totally locked out of the system. To forcibly remove anyone from STEM at this point would kill them and leave their consciousness trapped inside there. Great. That sucks. Mobius has got some stellar backup plans. Stating the obvious isn't going to speed things along. You need to find Lily. Otherwise, she, you, and everyone else inside is going to die. Okay, well, we're all gonna die. Just gonna know. A cat? I don't ever remember owning no, a cat. Not a cat. A cheetah. You guys can see that, right? Obviously. Slide projector? Where did my memory dig this up? Elementary school? Couldn't my memory just make regular doors? <sighs> that would be convenient, wouldn't it? Here we go again. Into the looking glass. Chapter two, something not quite right. Oh no. Lily, what's wrong? My doll's head is broke. It's okay. Mom can fix it for you. She can fix anything. Hmm. On and off the job tomorrow. Smart man. Sebastian? What's wrong? Are you all right? I've got a wonderful family. An amazingly smart and beautiful wife. Why wouldn't I be all right? Come here, Myra. He looks so happy. Nothing can make him feel more. You've been working too hard. It's Nothing making you delirious. Better. Are you sure you're not coming down with something? Is this the right place? Okay guys, well that's it for episode one. 
I'm going to do a little series of these, the continuous gameplay. This is just episode one. I'm going to cut it in chunks. That way it's not just one long three-hour video. All right, guys. Till next video. Later.